Good morning. We are starting the day today with a little bit of mowing. It's been raining a lot lately, so some of my mowing clients need to get the grass knocked down. So we're going to get that going and then finish some project. But surely these uh, outdoor areas coming together, got all the fixtures in place. Now we're just putting on the stones and doing some butt polishing to finish up and this one will be ready. Just finishing up. I uh, got the base laid out for the concrete pad, doing an eight by eight. I believe it's an eight by six shed, but this is an eight by eight pad. So there was a problem today at the house trying to figure out how to get some electricity so I can use the power tools, uh, cut apart some of these railroad ties and start getting everything in order. Probably take care of that problem today and come back tomorrow and keep cleaning and getting ready. Okay. Back here, uh, I've been taking out those uh, railroad ties and using the reciprocating saw, just uh, cutting them down. Um, some of them are rotted out, but for the most part, you still have to cut them. They're a little rough to handle sometimes, so we're gonna dispose of those tomorrow. Also getting the uh, spot ready for the slab. Um, base is down, and the wire mesh is in there, and uh, just warm it up tomorrow and get ready to pour that. And uh, it's going pretty smoothly so far. Going to class two, unload this stuff. Okay, got this load undone. About to head out. Had a uh blowout in my boot while I'm here at the landfill. So, I guess I'll just get rid of them here. All right, let's get a quick setup here. Got some fabric we're gonna put down today, cover the back, show you how it looks at the end. So we have the uh, fabric down, got my form set up in the corner, ready for the concrete slab. Uh, this fabric's ready for landscaping to go down. We're gonna put some crushed limestone on it and back this side's gonna be some raised flower beds starting Monday. And then next week we'll have the slab board and get some of some materials down. By the time everything's ready, we'll be getting the artificial grass and this whole area will be covered. All right. <laughs> There we go, that's the pile. We're gonna get started on that and put it on the back. Okay, we got all the uh, base and uh, three quarter inch crushed limestone down. Like to do a mix sometimes, three quarter inch base to dust with uh, three quarter inch crushed limestone. Um, mixes together pretty well. And then I'll just go over it again with some more base where needed and uh, get it compact. Over here at the car wash, I'm gonna get this table washed off. I'm gonna use it today to uh, cut some stone and uh, I got a little miter saw on top of it. So I'm gonna take advantage of that and just wash off the table right now and get to the site. All right. Out here at the uh, concrete dump, just getting some uh, concrete out of the way that piles up after we finish a few projects. <laughs> Tends to pile up sometimes. 
sometimes, so sometimes I'll wait until I have a little bit to come out here. It's kind of a little bit outside the city, and I'll see you in a bit. Getting my truck diagnosed by a mobile mechanic we've been using. Uh, sounds like the transmission might be going out, so let's deal with that. Well, I'm here. Uh, parking lot at Walmart. We we'll have to work truck. We are going to probably be selling it and uh, moving on to something different. So we'll see how that goes. Okay, the truck is sold and we will be moving on to something different. So I'm here at uh, Lowe's and uh, riding in a Honda today. We sold our truck recently and uh, it was costing us quite a few dollars in repairs and it was more than we wanted to handle so we decided to go ahead and get rid of it and uh, start saving some of that money that we were just throwing into it. So. We are using a Honda Accord right now, and I've set a you know job where I have all my tools there, so I don't really have to um, transport much. And uh, I'm gonna finish that job and then get the stuff out of there and move on to the next job. But for now, we'll be using this car only for a few weeks, and it should work out pretty good.